ahead and get started on the next fix, which is turning the three hit combo, try to knock it out. Placing this right here, doing this fix. So that's gonna be the next fix right here, and that's going side here. So I do it, you know, behind that wheel well. So I gotta take all that out, take the tire off, get it started before I go to work. All right, so this wheel is getting difficult to come off. So I put these back on loosely. Doing this technique of putting leverage on the inside of the uh, rim so it can give, you know, some leverage this way to pop it off. Now next, take this whole part off. I gotta work up inside here. I did not know that I had a no whole nother tire inside there. That, I did not know that. Okay, a little spare tire. Right now. These damn things right here is no joke. I think I'm gonna forget. The part is right here. So you know why I'm up under here, go ahead and clean this whole thing off. Sheesh. All right, so finally at my destination. Here's the part right here that I'm taking out. This whole piece. And here's the new piece right here. Going in, so, and all this came from up inside there. So basically, I take this little piece right here from the old uh, part, slide it on right there, then go ahead and slide that inside there. Put that on. Put that on. Pop it on back inside there and. You know, we set to go. Uh, I'm about to get right back inside here when I do my brakes and my, uh, you know, struts and all that stuff. I'm doing all that myself. Changing out all this. 
getting the code that regulates to this part, so I did that myself. Saved me a smooth 800 bucks. Playing all the other games in 2020. All right. So I'm test fire number one. Cleaning the solenoids didn't even work. So here's test fire number two. So in test fire number two, is going to be after placing the DMTL um, valve. So here we go. Number two, the white angle on this. You know, I still got a, I still got the uh, these right here. Don't forget about these. These are hard to get to from what I from what I've seen inside YouTube videos, other YouTube videos. Um, these sensors, camshaft position sensors. I think my timing is just off on my engine. You know what I'm saying? So I need to change the oil too. That can be a good a good thing you know to do next that's what i'm do very next and then i'm get to these because these are important too so all right so let's see it's still doing that high uh, idle ref thing is not that I'm uh, gas is super low too all right so still the same thing so I'm guessing it's not uh, the control valve sensor you know what in the last clip I said I feel like I didn't fix my fix but to be honest with you remember I was getting two codes and ever since I erased my codes this is the only one that came back up the camshaft position uh, timing is over retarded you know bank bank one you know so um I think once I change those out, that might actually fix it, you know, because um, I think that other the other code I was getting was actually for the part that I just replaced. I'm going to go ahead and look it back up on a YouTube video, but if I'm not mistaken, the code that I had got before this code was the code for that piece. So, yeah, I think I changed the right piece out, you know, so I think that part was bad. So I feel a little bit better, you know, I was feeling a little bit down a little bit. Ain't gonna be on, I'm, I'm going to be honest with you, but, you know, I feel a little bit better. And once I get this bad boy all the way together, Next is going to just be constantly doing cosmetic stuff. As you see, you guys see, I got, you know, some of the carbon fiber in. There's a little few cosmetic stuff, like, you know, got a little couple of lines there. So I'm going to redo this. Messed up here a little bit. But I think I'm going to keep that like it is. Ain't that big of a deal. As long as I like it. These parts are looking real good. That's definitely looking good. You know, so... Just little touches, little hints of carbon fiber. I still want to kind of do this whole thing, you know, in carbon fiber. Like, it'll look amazing looking at this from the outside of the window. Somebody be like, what the hell is that carbon fiber thing sitting in front of his window? You know, like, just, you know, just something different. I'm, I'm a different type of dude, you know, so. I'm about to go ahead and get up out of here. I'm trying to take me a little quick, you know, hour nap before I go to work, you know, so. That's what I've been doing every morning, wake up in the morning, come out here and just work on my uh, vehicle, you know. It just sucks that the one I'm driving is, just, you know, doing bad. And, I sh and some of the fixes I'm doing over here, I feel like I should do on that one too, you know. But I'm planning on selling that one anyways. I'm not planning on keeping it, so I'm not even, there ain't no point in me doing those fixes unless I want to sell it for a good price. But with that being said, people, you know, it's been your boy Emily, and I'm out.